So what's up guys, we are out at the property in Industria West where uh, food was being produced in a warehouse. The Department of Health is here to shut the warehouse down for poor health standards. As you guys can see, these are some of the products that are going to be tested to make sure that uh, there aren't any bad chemicals inside of them. You can see it ranges from biscuits, bottled water, we've got crisp, we've got vinegar, peri-peri sauce, tomato sauce, some barbecue sauce. They've got uh, toilet paper as well that they've been producing here. Uh, quite a lot over here as we walk further into the warehouse you can see some of the the flour and some of the ingredients that were used to make the to make the food as you come in over here you can see we've got cornstarch this is the start of the of the conveyor belt line uh, there are a lot of belt inspectors inside here making sure that they collect all the samples that they can as we go further into the warehouse over here to the left you guys can see all the crates of uh, of biscuits that were found here these biscuits were getting ready to be put into packaging over here you'll see they have a scale here where they weigh the, the biscuits uh, over here is a table with a lot more biscuits and fans to help the biscuits set. Uh, as we go further in, you'll see over here we've got some industrial baking trays. Uh, these obviously go into those ovens over there. Some more industrial equipment over here. And then uh, we've got some, some more ingredients here. And tables where they prepare the the batter for the biscuits and then they hoy that into uh, into the oven over here some nice industrial ovens so as you guys can see why the yalt department is here there are no yalt standards we've got a shoe over here laying next to the biscuits uh, as I go on to this side you'll see this is the sugar that they use they've got brown sugar here uh, We've got the packaging that they'll use once they're done because uh, this is where the sauce is made as well. These are some more industrial sauce machines. You can see over here we've got some empty packets where all the ingredients were. Uh, we've got the onions, garlic and that's obviously being added into the peri peri sauce in this nice industrial machine over here. And uh, like I say, you guys can see absolutely no regard to health. These are some of the bigger machines over here. Uh, if you look on the inside there, some are emptier because they've already filled bottles up. Over here, another machine that they use to fill the bottles up. As you guys can see what they look like inside. And uh, I can guarantee these things haven't been cleaned, guys. Look at the edges of this thing. Look what it looks like. Uh, that's not all, guys. That's not all. So, over here to our left, this is where the, the vinegar, imitation vinegar, is made. We got some black vinegar over there. Uh, see, we got stools over there where the workers sit for the tables. These are the other little drums that they're making these things in and then they're obviously pouring it out and packaging it here the worst part of it all is that uh, the conditions that these people here have to deal with the workers themselves guys so I'm gonna take you into the bathroom this is the bathroom that the workers have to use it's absolutely appalling that people are still made to live under these conditions in this day and age. I mean, guys, as we walk in here, I don't know what this little wall is for here. But uh, this is what the toilet floor looks like. You guys don't want to even know what it smells like in here, guys. 
absolutely appalling. It's terrible what it smells like. Ooh. These are the conditions that the workers have to use the toilet in. So this is the only basin that I saw on the property while I was here guys. Let's keep in mind that this is a, uh, a food warehouse and there are no basins inside. This is the only basin on the property. <laughs>